One Wabash Valley School Corporation is facing major budget cuts. It's not the first time the Northeast School Corporation in Sullivan County has had to deal with budget cuts. In tonight's Education Watch 10, News 10's Hunter Petroviak has more on how school administrators are preparing for the change. Students are hard at work wrapping up the school year in the Northeast School Corporation. When they return to school next year, there could be some changes. Budget cuts are forcing school administrators to potentially reduce teachers and programs, something Superintendent Mark Baker isn't looking forward to. Unfortunate for those that are out there thinking, is it me or not? I mean, the undue stress that we're putting on our people, it's, you know, it's tough. Last year, the corporation had to cut $2.2 million from the budget, closing two buildings. This year, $500,000. Baker says rural schools seem to be getting the short end of the deal. You know, we've been able to give quality programs. You know, we have kids that come out of these small rural schools that are doing great things in society, and they've had a meaningful education. We want to continue that piece, and, uh, but it, the state is just making it harder and harder. Baker says they're hoping to be able to spread the cuts out over a few years, and there's talk for a potential referendum. But when it comes down to it, they have the students' best interests in mind. You know, at this point, we're hoping with the, the cuts that we make, we'll, we'll balance us and we'll still have a quality product, and our kids will, you know, be able to meet their college goals, their life goals, you know, wherever they plan to go once they graduate from Northeast. In Hymira with photojournalist Tony Cassasia, Hunter Petroviak, News 10. The last day of school for the Northeast School Corporation is next Friday. School administrators hope to have a firm plan in place by the end of school.